Hi everyone, it's Ari with iGrow, and today we're going to explain the origins of light deprivation in greenhouses and explain why iGrow 365 is the premier greenhouse control systems for light deprivation. Light deprivation, otherwise known as light dep, is the process of forcing plants to flower with sunlight in a time of year that is not normally the flowering period for the sun's natural lighting cycle. Since the dawn of time, farmers have understood the role of light in plant growth. However, it wasn't until the beginning of the 20th century that we began to understand the importance of darkness. Photoperiodism is the technical term for a plant's biological response to a shift in the proportion of light and dark in a 24-hour cycle. Photoperiodic plants measure hours of darkness in order to keep track of the seasons ensuing that they flower at the appropriate time of the year. There are different types of flowering plants. Long-day plants flower naturally in high summer, when the nights are shortest. Short-day plants flower naturally when the nights are long, either in early spring or in late summer and early autumn. Short-day species include chrysanthemums, poinsettias, rice, and some varieties of marigolds, orchids, and strawberries. Cannabis is also a short-day plant. While short-day is a widely used terminology, it is actually something of a misnomer. Short-day plants actually sense darkness, not light. When sensors in your plant's leaves indicate that each 24-hour cycle includes 12 or more hours of sustained, uninterrupted darkness, your plant's apical meristems, which are the growing tips, will shift priorities. Instead of producing more leaves and stems, the plant will begin to produce floral structure. So when applying photoperiodism to plants, the most important factor is the timing of the light and dark periods, or, to think of it another way, the times at which the transition between light and dark take place. Commercial farmers started using large light curtains and shades to assist them in controlling the photoperiodism in plants and also as a way to stop light pollution for the supplemental lights that were being run during short sun periods. As more farms started using supplemental lighting, it became apparent that large custom commercial light deprivation systems needed to be developed. In this regard, iGrow365 has helped customize these commercial light deprivation techniques to specifically meet the unique needs of cannabis growers and take advantage of their significant abilities. Light deprivation is an ideal method for farmers who want to bring a crop to market before the market becomes saturated during the traditional harvest seasons. Light deprivation offers growers the opportunity to plant and harvest up to three times more throughout the course of the year, thereby tripling annual income. To augment the technology provided by the iGrow365, we've also created the most advanced environmental control system for light depth technology that will allow you to take full advantage of the photoperiodic crop's potential. iGrow365 is so sophisticated that you can actually take your specific strain and customize a photoperiod based on the plant's ancestral geographic location, which will maximize the quality and quantity of the plant by taking advantage of its genetic makeup. Amazing what technology and farmers can do.